Hello, welcome to a mug full of wine and our weekly grocery haul. I will start by sharing our menu for the week. Um, today is Monday. Well, while I'm videoing, it's Monday. You'll see it on Wednesday. We're having blackberry turkey panini and some chips and probably some fruit. Um, tomorrow, Tuesday, we're having chicken paprika, homemade mashed potatoes and salad. Wednesday we are having um, hot Italian sandwiches and on Wednesday for home ec the kids are making root beer floats so we purchased stuff for that. Um, Thursday we are having blueberry pancakes and sausage. Friday we're having French dip sammies. Saturdays we go out and Sunday we're trying a new recipe. It is margarita, chicken skillet, and a salad, and some garlic bread. So that is our menu plan for the week. This was my grocery list. Uh, as you can see, it's very well organized. Um, so before I went grocery shopping, I gave myself a budget of $175. I came in more than $25 lower. Um, we went to three stores. We went to Costco, Walmart, and Trader Joe's. I will show my Walmart haul first. I spent $120 at Walmart. I spent $10 at Trader Joe's, and I spent $20 at um, Costco. So I came in under budget by um, $25. Yay! So this is the Walmart haul. This, again, we are a family of five, sometimes six. This week it will only be five, um, I believe. I cook dinner seven, six nights a week. We go out on Saturdays, and I provide breakfast and lunch for my family um, seven days a week, and we have snacks. So this is our haul. I have a package, and excuse the light. It's 4 o'clock in the afternoon, and my lighting in the house is terrible. Plus, it's supposed to snow like 6 to 12 inches tonight, so it's really dark outside. And excuse my dogs if they think it's time to eat. I have a package of cream cheese, some spreadable butter, Mackenzie's uh, vanilla macchiato creamer. This creamer we purchased for the first time last week. It's Dunkin' Donuts chocolate. It's really pretty good. It's not an overpowering chocolate flavor, so I picked that up. Mackenzie wanted some almond milk. We got some yogurt. Um, this is strawberry. Some cottage cheese. Some whipped cream. We're going to have that with our pancakes. Two packages of iceberg lettuce, a big old package of chicken breast, Oops. a big package of chicken breast. We got some um, California mix. It's like spicy and it has jalapenos and carrots and cauliflower. We have um, jardinier in the fridge, but there's not much left. And two, I think two of the recipes that we have this week called for jardinier. I don't eat it. The kids don't eat it, but my husband does, so I picked that up. Some blackberry jam. This is for our paninis tonight. Some blueberry pie topping. Three containers of French onion with onion soup. This makes the ju the aju for the Italian uh, dipped sandwiches. Some diced tomatoes, Stanley. Knock it off. Two pa two uh, cans of diced tomatoes, a box of sausage, one wheels and cheese for Piper's lunch. We really didn't buy much lunch stuff because everything that we're going to have this week, we will probably have leftovers. We have leftovers from last night's dinner that we can eat tomorrow for lunch, and um, we have peanut butter and jelly. We have some vanilla Ice cream for our root beer floats the kids are going to make. I ran out of Pam this week, or you know, the generic Pam. We needed sugar. We got some cranberry black cherry juice. Two things of root beer. Some potatoes for our mashed potatoes. My sweet tea. I'm almost out. Some black forest chopped ham. I usually don't buy prepackaged um, lunch meats. They're very high in sodium and... I am not really supposed to have any sodium. So, but this recipe that I, the kids and I are making on Wednesday night, it calls for packaged and, I mean, I don't know. I We've had them before and the kids ate them, which surprised me, so I'm just sticking with what I know. Some salami, some pepperoni, 
some roast beef, and two packages of provolone, one package of Swiss, some fresh mozzarella, a container of paprika, Hungry Jack, or Hungry Jack, um, pancake mix, two boxes of penne pasta, um, our bread is a loaf of white bread, some deli rolls, those are for the sandwiches on Wednesday, a bag of chips, our non-grocery items, we have some freezer bags, I go through so many freezer bags, do other people go through as many freezer bags as I do? I think I went through a 40 pack box, 40 bag box in less than a month, and it's not like I'm using them for silly things, I think I'm just using them for food storage, I don't know. Uh, Mackenzie needed some Three Minute Miracle. We got Grandpa some food. We have our, um, our Piper needed Barrettes. I needed Pepto-Bismol tablets. Hi. Mackenzie also needed some hair ties. Our favorite, um, wow, the wind really picked up. Our favorite uh, paper towels. I got some plastic party red solo cups for um, the uh, Rupert floats so that it's just easier to throw them away than wash them. That is our Walmart haul. Again, I spent 120 at Walmart. I will put this stuff away and get out the Trader Joe's and I'll probably get out Costco and Trader Joe's and just do it all in one fell swoop since they're both pretty small. I will be back. Alright, I'm back with my Trader Joe's haul. This is all. It's ten dollars. Um, some milk, of course, my Trader Joe's milk. Yeah. Liam. Piper Mackenzie wanted some inner peas. We had some butter. Two lemons and Mackenzie's reduced reduced guilt mac and cheese that she always gets. And then at Costco, this cost twenty dollars. We got um, these tortas. We're having panini tonight, so we thought it'd be fun to put them on tortas. Some these. Oh my god! First of all, we got we got this turkey. We're gonna have this tonight. This was a sample. My family loves Indian food. Like, there's an Indian restaurant. Yes, loves right. Yeah. There's an Indian restaurant that used to be about a minute away from our house that we went to um, before my kids were born. And then for a long time after my kids were born, we would walk in and the mama, the wife of the owner, would take the kids away so that we could eat. She'd play with the kids when they're little tiny babies. And then when they started eating, she would make them special things. And we love Indian food. These are Lay's Tikka Masala potato chips. I don't like kettle cooked chips at all. Like, despise them. I could not stop eating these. I cannot wait to rip open this bag. And Daddy's off the phone. Yeah. They taste, oh, they're so, I mean, they were really good. We thought about maybe getting two bags because we're afraid we might eat them all in one sitting. Yeah. They're amazing. But they taste like curry with rice. Mm -hmm. Like the Indian seasonings. And the yeah, it, they're really good. So if you it's like so Indian good. food, go to Costco and find these. She said she didn't know how long they were going to be there. They are the out of this edition, world. Limited edition. A limited edition yeah. there. Retired. Out of this world. And I don't like kettle cooked chips. And these, oh, can't wait to open them. And that was my Costco haul. It was $20. So my total was 130 at, no, 120 at Walmart, 10 at Trader Joe's. That brings it to 130 And 20 at um, Costco. So that brings it to 150 My Budget was one seventy five, so I came in twenty five dollars under budget. And I think I should buy some shoes with that money. Should I buy some shoes? No, I'm not going to buy shoes. Just joking. That is our grocery haul for this week. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have not yet yeah, up, if you have not subscribed, please punch that subscribe button and subscribe. If you are already subscribed, welcome back, and we will see you next Wednesday. Bye. Hello. I have a quick Sam's Club haul. Very interesting story. We went to a home and business expo today in our town, and Sam's Club was there. We have a Costco membership that we've had for a while, and um, we talked to 
the people running it and they were able to offer us a pretty good deal. They also gave us these two boxes of Annie's organic uh, macaroni and cheese for free. And I was eyeballing this basmati rice. It's brown basmati rice. We eat a lot of basmati and jasmine rice. And basmati rice is pretty expensive and I was eyeballing it and I asked if they had tried it and he said, just take it home with you. And I mean, this thing is a ginormous bag. It has, I don't know how much it costs. But anyway, so we got those for free at the expo, and then we ran to get our pictures taken for our Sam's card, and we picked up the Cinnabon Gooey Bites. Um, my husband has a friend who bought these and said, you have to try them. They are fantastic. She sent him a picture of them. We couldn't find them at Walmart, and that's where I believe she bought them. So we found them, and they had a taste test going on. Um, I will not be able to enjoy them because they have cinnamon. We got these two packages of mustard. Mm. I can no longer eat the Aldi mustard. I do not like the taste of it. This was um, less than $4 for two. That was a pretty good deal. Piper talked us into getting some Rice Krispie treats because she doesn't like real Rice Krispie bars. We got some drumsticks to go with our Oscar dinner tomorrow night. I needed more, and this is a very good price. It's less than what we spent at um, Costco. And then my stepdaughter, she said these are fantastic mini brownie bites. So we bought those that we can snack on later tonight. And that is our very small haul. This stuff cost $30 for the five things right here. And then this stuff was free. And that's our <laughs> haul.